This is Math 142, and this is the, uh, the final practice. This is question number one. And for this question, we are supposed to find uh, the exact value of all six trig functions of this value right here. Uh, theta is negative 2 pi over 3. So let's use our unit circle and figure out where this, where this happens at. So um, 2 pi over 3, if I think about positive 2 pi over 3, it's here. So that would be this rotation to here. So a negative rotation of the same amount would be to here. So this is the same, uh, and by the same, I mean coterminal as 4 pi over 3. And you could also get that by, by going 2 pi, a full rotation minus that 2 pi over 3. Um, but however you get it, you get it. And so then now we know these values are associated with it, the x value and the y value. So we can get all of those values then, sine of it, cosine of it, tangent. And in the unit circle, we know that sine is height, sine is the y value, so it's negative root 3 over 2. Cosine is the x value, negative 1 half. And as I keep going from there, tangent is, is y over x, so that would be negative root 3 over 2 over negative 1 half. And you can notice that the, the negatives will divide out and the 1 halves will divide out. So that just leaves me a square root of 3. And then um, the other reciprocal values are pretty easy to get at. If I uh, look at if I look at secant, I can uh, take a reciprocal of negative one half, so that's negative two. Cosecant, take a reciprocal of sine, so that'd be negative two over root three. And if I rationalize that denominator, that's going to be negative two root three over three. And then tangent is root three, so cotangent would be one over root three. Again, if I rationalize that root 3 over 3, and there they all are.